Hi guys. So basically, I haven't recorded a video in such a long time, but I figured since summer started, and last year if you caught my the summer bucket list video, um, I basically just doing a repeat of that, but for this year's summer. Um, so I'm just gonna read off the list and basically explain why I, ch I chose this for my bucket list, to be on my bucket list. First is to go on a carnival trip with some friends. Um, I love the idea of just going to the carnival in general, but then when you're your friends, it's even more fun because everybody's excited, high spirited, and really bring back your like childhood feelings and everything. Second is to go on a picnic with friends. I am like a big picnic person. I've always really liked going to picnics because it's fun to just sit around in the sun, like on your blanket, and I'm it's very TV-like and I kind of like it. Um, that's one of the really things I like from TV, kind of. Uh, you're basically just chilling out, and especially some really good tunes playing. Like uh, if you go to Millennium Park and have a concert there at the moment, it's just a beautiful, beautiful experience. Or if you're at the beach and just nice waves, the breeze and everything it feels really good. And then the next thing is to go take the metro or metro to some really cool place with some friends and you know um, experience a real true summer like outside of your comfort zones because usually you can go to the same place with your friends like we have a certain place to go but then with this you go on the metro you just feel like that's just some random shop that you probably would have gotten off of regularly and I've never been on the metro so I figured that'd be a wonderful experience to just try it and say I heard it's very comfortable and very sweet. The next thing will be to have a dinner party. I mean, even if it's like going to one of your friend's house and um, everybody has like, a, it's like a potluck and everybody brings like one of their favorite dishes and we like sample it out to each other. I think that'd be really awesome because it, I mean, it kind of reminds me like of before. I get a lot of my ideas from like TV, television shows or just idealistic things. But if you go like, um, like everybody brings stuff together. We try to read one food, like say it's vegan or something like that. You try different this is like trying different things and you know, enjoying each other's company and just wonderful way to keep keep up with your friends over the summer because they can be going on trips and you can be staying in town and it's a wonderful way to connect with each other. They will tell you what happened during your summer. It's been a wonderful thing to do towards the end and you know, recap everything you've done over the summer. The next thing is to lose um, some kind of like lose some weight, you know. Um, really do the get the peak spot kind of thing, uh, but you know it's just wonderful to because I feel like I'm going to my senior year of high school now and I feel whatever you look like in your senior year is how you're gonna look for the rest of your life. Your life so why not try to be who I want to be for the rest of my life? I don't know. I'm going where I am now, but you know I always want to better. That's the whole thing to better yourself every day. Um, the next thing is to start a better, healthier lifestyle that really connects with my following. I'm supposed to before. You know, like a healthier lifestyle, you know, stuff. eating fries all the time, although I really love eating fries, you know, I still actually I just have sports today. That's not besides the point, but basically, um, just trying to eat and live a healthy lifestyle, even if it's not eating much, but exercise in general, and just like being active all the time, that's wonderful way to, you know, just be really good about yourself, and all that jazz. And then... So the, and the next thing will be to um, the next thing will be to write my personal essay since I am going to my senior year. Um, I'm going to start uh, applying for colleges and everything, and to do that, I'm going to need to write a personal essay. And I really want to be like have a rough draft of that, so when I go into my senior year, I can already be ahead of the game and be prepared and say like, boom, I already have my rough draft of my personal essay. Can you edit it for me? And I'll just be ready to apply to all the colleges that I can. And then the next thing will be to um, buy five pair of awesome shoes that are going to last me at least to, towards the middle of the winter time. Because um, I really want to get some shoes that like, you, like my go-to shoes, but I know that if I wear them every single day, they're still going to last me for a really long time. I really need some shoes like that in my life. I said at least five so they can you know, transition throughout the week. I mean like Monday, Tuesday, Monday through Friday, and then Saturday, Sunday, you can like just jump into it, you know, I don't know, wear some random shoes that probably aren't going to last the weekend or something like that. I don't know. And then the, that's it. That's all there is for my bucket list. I'm, of course, there are many other things that I would like to put on here, 
Um, but I didn't want this to go forever. And uh, this is basically what I thought of off of the split of the second. I was just like writing down some of the list of ideas and everything that I was going to make for this video. And occasionally I'm going to probably come up with some new ones. But you can check out. I'm probably going to talk about those on my um, vlog channel. I'm starting to upload daily vlogs on my vlog channel. So you can go ahead and check that out. There's a link in the bio. I mean, I keep saying bio. There's a link in the description box uh, <laughs> to a link to my vlog channel. And throughout the whole summer, I'm posting every daily, so just go and check that out and subscribe to this channel if you're not subscribed already. Give this video a like and comment down below some of your summer bucket list ideas because um, I would love to hear some of the things you're doing. Because I probably might do them as well because they might just be really awesome ideas. Um, so I'll catch you guys next Thursday with a new video. Hope you have a fantastic night or day or whatever you're watching this video. And